Welcome to Halo Combat Evolved Legendary Part 3. Today I'm going to beat another two missions, 343 Guilty Spark and the Library. A lot of people look at the Library and they think it's the most difficult level in Halo Combat Evolved, but I disagree. This cutscene, this intro was so creepy as well, by the way, growing up. This whole level was so good in the original. I will never play this level in the updated graphics. Because I think it just butchered the whole atmosphere of it. Last transmission from the captain's dropship was from this area. That was over 12 hours ago. When you locate Captain Keys, radio in, and I'll come pick you up. Like, look how creepy this is. This is legendary. So I believe we don't get a shotgun here. The music, you know, it's it's all kind of weird all kind of strange but yeah no i don't think this is the most um the library is the most difficult level in combat evolved it's most certainly two betrayals which is the level that comes immediately after all right get rid of you the creepiest part is just up here because you actually get to see the flood before you before their full reveal like look there's a flood Right there. But, he runs away. And when you get up here, there's no sign of him. You can see people, you can see something attacking the Covenant and them fleeing. But you go in here and there's nothing here. This level, man, as a kid, it gave me nightmares. But... Still got some Covenant to deal with. That'll do it. You can see uh, all the, the blood stains. You have no idea what caused them. Stay back! Stay back! You're not turning me into one of those things! I'll throw your Oh my... I mean, you can tell it's legendary. I just wanted to hear the dialogue. I suppose I could have just, you know... Stepped out of the way. Please give me a health pack. Because <laughs> I'm re i in desperate. Oh, there we go. Uh-oh. Uh oh. Come to think of it, yeah, I definitely should not have been playing this game when I was four or five years old. Stay close, Jenkins! Mendoza! Move it up! Wait here for the captain and his squad, then get your ass inside. Sir! Okay, let's move! Which is weird, right? I mean, look at it. Something scrambled the insides. What's that? Plasma scoring? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe there was an accident, you know, friendly fire or something. What do we have, Sergeant? Looks like a Covenant patrol. Badass elite units. All KIA. Real pretty. Friend of yours? Nah, we just met.
Right. Well, let's get this door open. I'll try, sir. But it looks like these Covenant work pretty hard to lock it down. Just do it, son. Yes, sir. Got a bad feeling about this. Boy, you always got a bad feeling about Captain something. Captain Stark, can you hear me? What's going on, soldier? He's got contacts, lots of them, but they're not coming in. They're, they're just staring through us. What the fuck? No! Corporal, do you copy? Over. Mendoza, get your ass back up to second squad's position and find out what the hell is going on. But I don't have time for your lip, soldier. I gave you an Sarge, order. Sarge, listen. What is that? Where's that coming from, Everywhere. Mendoza? I don't... There! Mira! Ah, hold still! Out. Hold get still! Let him have it! Ah. Sergeant, we're surrounded. God damn it, Jenkins! Fire your weapon! There are too many, Sergeant! Don't even think about what it. What is Key shooting at? There's nothing over there. Dude's missing every single oh, shot. And now we're in the same exact room. Just knowing that these things are here somewhere. The assault rifle is really good for taking these little popcorn fellas out. Oh, music's kicking in, you know what that means. Uh, it means I just wasted a whole fucking grenade, that's what it means. Uh oh. Oh, my grenade, uh, grenade, my re reloading thing isn't working for some reason. I think my uh, X button is a bit unresponsive, but you can double tap reload. Switch to a different weapon and it will reload while you've got the other one out. But it's not working all too often for me. Because I don't think one of the inputs is going through. Oh well. Yeah, anyway, the mission is uh, escape, so that's exactly what the fuck I'm going to do. Covenant are distracting them down there. Not for long though, they'll be dead instantly. through this door here, hopefully without alerting them. What room is this? Oh, it's this room. Oh shit. I, okay, I was in a completely different room to what I thought I was in. So, whether or not I make it out alive right now. There are some Covenant. Okay, we made it. Man, I thought there was a shotgun there. I suppose it's just on easy mode. flood in this area too. There are marines in this room. They stand no chance whether I'm with them or not. So give me this shotgun and they can be a good distraction to let me through. Because again, they, they stand no chance. There's no saving them. And while I have the camo, I'm just going to aim to dart it as quick as I can to, well, the exit. Oh, 
should be running out about now. If I can make it through that door, it'd be good. Uh-oh. Yeah, it's running out. Okay, we got through this door. I ain't gonna be able to skip anything in here, though. Okay, looks like we're good. What's going on down there? I'm there we go. All over the place. Marines. I right, gotta go through a swamp infested with flood. But with the music, I feel like a, I feel unstoppable to be honest. So. Marines don't sound like they're having a good time, and to be honest, neither am I. I'm losing shields very quickly. Yeah, they seem to be all dead already. It's a shame. The mission ends not when you've killed all the Flood, but when all the Sentinels are dead. Thankfully, it's legendary, so it shouldn't take too long. But I do have to su- Whoa! There we go. Monitor of installation 04. I am 343 Guilty Spark. Someone has released the flood. My function is to prevent it from leaving this installation. But I require your assistance. Come this way. Awesome. We must collect the index before we can activate the installation. But this is the level everybody dreads in a Halo 1 playthrough. It's essentially just... Oh. Essentially just, um... Endless rounds of flood. Endless waves of flood as you make it all the way up to the top. Multiple elevators worth of flood. It's not as bad as two betrayals though, because I think that's a much worse level. Oh, is that a shotgun? I would like that. Shit, where did it go? Is that it? Yes. You can use the carrier forms as grenades. Oh, who's shooting me? I think this is the one part where they just infinitely spawn. Oh, fuck. He had no arms. He was no threat. Um, yeah, there's an overshield here. Didn't know if it was in this one. Th this is just like infinite rooms that just look identical, so... It does kind of... Am I gonna live? Oh, my shotgun's nearly out. This installation's research facilities are most impressive. Perhaps we have time to see them later. Why are you... Wow, the Sentinels coming at a fantastic time after I've already killed everyone. Nice. Well, that's the first elevator. That part was quite tough, actually, the, the last bit. I'm thinking of what's the second floor like? I think the second floor's probably the easier one. But as you see, I mean, if you, if you haven't played this game, you're probably going to get lost. That, I think that maybe that's why people don't like the library. One tip you can do here is just wait and nothing will spawn. But... If we walk over here, because we need this door to unlock, basically. So if I just waited there, I wouldn't have to fight anything. But if I go over here, though, everything starts spawning. So, 
I'm just killing it because why not? Why not? Let's have a battle, shall we? This is the library after all. What fun would it be if we didn't actually partake in battle? I see a shotgun on- oh, I think I blew the fuck out of it. Wait. Look at- look at how many enemies there are! Oh my god. Alright, let's do it. Let's- let's actually just do it. You can completely skip this fight. But let's do it. Cause fuck it. God, we're gonna have to use these guys as strategic grenades. Okay. Get me out of here. Okay, maybe this level is uh, kind of shit. Again, you uh, you can skip a lot of the fights. So that's what I'm saying. Like, if you know how to play the level, you can just skip that fight over there if you just don't trigger the enemies. Um, this fight here, you don't have to do it if you just go around this side. You know, like, all these enemies over here... You can just jump across the these and walk around. That's all you gotta do. The library is all about knowing what you can skip and what you can't skip. That's that's really it. I'm gonna take this way though, because again, why not? But also ammo. If these guys have shotguns, I would like to pick up some ammo. In fact, do any of these ones have rocket launchers? Whoa, that's a lot of flood. Not quite as much as we just dealt with. Ah, we killed the guy with the rocket. You know what, I'll take that. Oh, okay, that was... <laughs> That killed no one. Please don't shoot me before I can shoot you. Oh, nice. I just seen him walking towards me with the rocket launcher. The installation was well conceived. It is surely the only way to end the blood threat. Here's the next elevator. So I was actually thinking of a completely different floor. But that's done now. See ya, buddy. Oh. But I don't want to ride the elevator. Another corridor. Not a big fan of these parts. You got a shotgun? I'm... 
Okay, well that was hilarious. I was- I could feel my controller vibrating. Come on now, what was that for? It's mainly the carrier forms, because you can't like, just run up to them and sh start shooting. You have to play it safe. Jump up here again. Defend me! Alright, this bit's kind of tough. It's another defensive mission. Or wait until the fucking door. Wait until the monitor opens the damn door. Stop reloading and fucking shoot! It's not as bad as the last one, not even close, but still. In fact, the when the door opens, that's when this becomes a bit difficult because, well, we'll see. There we go. Finally got the thing open. Yep, that, that guy right there. And I'm actually going to collect his ammo. Flood with rocket launchers, not the best combination. Wow, that could have been bad. Chain reaction. Hey look, we've got a friendly. Let's keep him alive, shall we? Let's hope aim assist doesn't fuck me up with that rocket launcher though. Look, we've got a friendly! Holy shit, I'm getting shredded apart by them infection forms. Hello, Mr. Flood. What can I do for you today? Well, I mean, if you want to come along with me, you can. I'll keep you alive, buddy. I'll let you watch. Oh, right, stay back. Enemies. Holy shit, Mr. Flood, why do your buddies have to rip me apart so quickly? Oh my god. Like, do me a favor. Go and get that fucking health pack over there. Bring it back for me. Oh, wait. You've got no arms. All right. Coast is clear. Come on. Not for long, I suspect. Oh, wait. I might have killed him. I can't even take some... I can't even take time to check... This bit's the worst, it quite literally makes you wait like two minutes. And you can just, again, I think a lot of the fights in this level can actually just be entirely skipped. Because I feel like every time I've gotten to one of these sections, I've been talking about a way of how you can just not deal with it. But here, it's to just stand where I was behind this little pillar, and they just won't see you. Yeah, and then it opens, and you, well, wait for it to very slowly actually open, and then Sentinels are here. They'll finish the job, or at least they'll attempt to, and you can move on. And that is the next floor complete. Back on the elevator. Oh, you made it. Fourth floor, and a tough one. That saves you from going under the tunnel. It's not long, but the end of the level is coming up, and it's kind of bullshit. It's just a swarm of them. Which you should be used to by now. Whoa! Don't come near me! Oh, uh, wait. I think we're bugged, actually. I think we're bugged. The monitor isn't doing anything. You're supposed to be unlocking the door right now. And I'm fighting for my life here. No, nope, it's open. Never mind. Alright, I've got a decent amount of ammo. I've got one rocket. But we're approaching the end now. 
just around this corner, and it's just a swarm. Basically, you gotta wait for this to open fully. And there's a ton of enemies. But, it's actually when it opens when it becomes a problem. Because there's even more. Blow up, blow up, all of you blow up. I think the door might have opened. I think these are the ones that have come through the door. Am I right? Yeah, looks like it. While it might look like it's over, it almost certainly isn't. There's a lot- I need to make it over there, but there's a lot more of them around, and I think they spawn in too. So let's just- yep. Oh, they've spawned in alright. Give me the cutscene! Give me the cutscene! Come on! Okay, we did it. <laughs> the energy barrier surrounding the index will deactivate when we reach the ground floor. Retrieve the index. What are those infection forms doing? Protocol uh -oh. requires that I take possession of the index for transport. Your organic form renders you vulnerable to infection. The index must not fall into the hands of the flood before we reach the control room and activate the installation. The flood is spreading. We must hurry. Well, that is going to be it for today. We've only got three more missions left. I might finish it in the next video. Depends on, I guess, whether or not I do the keys skip. Because you can make keys a really short level. If I do that, I might finish it in the next video. But either way, thank you for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Definitely subscribe if you're new here. And I will see you all in my next video.